okay today we are going to discuss about the serial data communication in 8051 okay the serial data communication in the sense you need to transfer the data one after another uh, because while we are transferring the data in the parallel uh, it may be the more expensive because while uh, for example if you are connecting with the printer with the computer suppose if you are using the long length cable the data has been maybe destroyed or data signal has been lost okay so for this reasons we are going for the serial data communication in the serial data communication you can transfer the data in the long distance okay from the 100 feet to millions of mile apart we can transfer the data without loss any signals okay that that's why we selected for the uh, serial data communication in the 8051 so here what are all the if we inside the block we can use for the parallel inputs okay the microcontroller the parallel inputs and serial output we can Uh, select because the serial data in the sense we can send the data that is the output signal to the many applications so in the serial data transfer it, it is the example block that is the center and receiver the so one after another we can send the data the microcontroller it, it can possible up to the 8 bit data transfer the parallel in the sense we can uh, 8 bit data we can send as well as the receive between the input to the performance unit or control unit so it may be used for the internal blocks of the microcontroller the serial data communication we can use for the output uh, applications okay so in this uh, for this uh, purpose we, they, they uh, further it may classified in the two categories one is the uh, synchronous mode and another uh, one is the asynchronous mode of data transfer so in this case many manufacturer they are um, uh, made some ics that is the special ics Uh, commonly we can call it as the UART and USART the universal asynchronous receiver transmitter and universal synchronous asynchronous data transmitter so both are it may used for the serial data communications for many real time uh, applications like uh, while you are communicating with your uh, people we are using the mic as well as the telephones or mobile phones so that all it may taken for the special ics it while they, we are making the transfer data transfer it may used for the many modulations like uh, amplitude modulation frequency modulation all are it made so if you are making any modulation that may come under the category of asynchronous data transfer if without any modification the data has been uh, transferred from one system to another system that we can call it as the synchronous data transfer it may taken three different modes so you can consider this all the center side this is the receiver side it may further classified in the three modes of operation that is the simplex mode and half duplex mode and full duplex mode in the simplex mode we can't get any data from the receiver side okay only we can give the input to the receiver for example printer suppose a computer it is connected to the printer from the computer you are giving the input so whatever input you are given based on your command it may print whatever the document you are given for the print that may perform it so from the printer we can cut any uh, input signal to the computer so that is the simple uh, simplex mode of data trans transfer in the serial data communication so if you are consider in the half duplex so here you see both the side the center side it's have both the transmitter and receiver similarly the receiver side also the receiver and transmitter is there okay in the both four block at a time any one any two of block it may work okay it means the center side if it, it is work to the transmitter if it is the center side the transmitter is transmit the data in the receiver side only the receiver is performing or receiving or it can capable to receive the data at the same time the transmitter it was not working okay but if the center side the receiver is receiving the data at the receiver side the transmitter alone it may be work okay it means that the transmitter and receiver only working at a time in the both the cases okay so that is why it is the half duplex method it is not a five directional communication for example we can consider any of um, inputs like drone or uh, some other uh, way tracking or gps tracking okay this all it may used for the half duplex sorry consider but in the half duplex it have the major drawback at instantly it can't able to transmit the data while the receiving the data it can't able to transmit any data to the center side so that was the major drawback in the half duplex method so that is why they are uh, uh, modifying the half duplex into the full duplex so the full duplex we can send the data 
from the sender side you can transmit the data as well as the receiver side it can also receive as well as it will it can capable to send the output signal to the receiver based on this it may like worked like closed loop systems okay we can send the data here it is receiving and performing then it is it has been sent it to back to the center side then based on the input it can modify so that is at presently we are using in the mobile phone okay you can consider for the mobile phone you are talking with your friend or neighbor or relative so they are replying it in the instantly the process has been taken whatever you are talking their words they are receiving and they are also replying that words you are receiving so it is the bidirectional communication in many real time application the full duplex method we are using for the effective communications effective communication of serial data communications in the 8051 likewise uh, but in the uh, real time while you are considering the real time the microcontroller 8051 we are not using it was a very fundamental uh, chip Uh, based on this we are going for many real time applications in the advanced devices like uh, node mcu arduino and all okay but this was the fundamental Th these three modes of uh, serial data communication taken place while uh, we are uh, transferring the data okay if you have any doubt you may ask